Gonzalez here, the CEO and co-founder of Sailfish Royalty Corp. Sailfish is a precious metals royalty company with assets in the Americas, laser focused on returning cash to shareholders. We've done this in two forms. One is a share buyback, where we've purchased almost 8 million of our own shares in the past two plus years. And most recently, uh, on September 8th, we press released our inaugural dividend. It equates to about a 4.6% dividend yield at today's prices. It is the highest dividend of any precious metals royalty company, and it's completing on our promise that we set out when we created the company. There are a couple other things that Sailfish is focused on at the time, and that is growing cash flow of our stream and royalty on an asset in Nicaragua, the highest open pit gold mine on the planet, and that's San Albino. That is helping support the dividend, is helping support share buybacks. And then also a couple of other catalysts are the spin out of our silver property in Mexico called Gavilanes. It's in the state of Durango in the prolific San Dimas mining district. And also, I just got back from conferences in Colorado, Beaver Creek and Colorado Springs, and there was a lot of buzz about Nevada, particularly MA. Waterton has sold Ruby Hill which is a deposit that they acquired at the same time they acquired Spring Valley. We own a 3% NSR on Spring Valley, a multi-million ounce deposit, one of the largest undeveloped deposits in all of Nevada for gold. And it was music to my ears that they are finally transacting. So we're, we've made a promise to shareholders. We've completed our promises, buying back shares, now paying the highest dividend yield of any royalty company, cash flow growth from San Albino. We have the spin out of Gavilanes, and the sale of Spring Valley, which hopefully happens sometime soon from Waterton. Thank you very much, and I look forward to answering any future questions.